Hello and welcome back to Official Virtuale. Let's continue our beginner series and today in mechanical design and part design let's talk about a scale. As you can see here we got this comma to enable this comma we need something so let's sketch something on a y-x plane and let's click for example we can sketch our first circle here and let's say 100 and we can select that this distance, uh, the distance between this center and our origin. Uh, we can say 100, okay. And now exit workbench using our pet command, we can obtain this prisma, okay. Now let's select our YX plane and let's sketch something else. And for example, we can sketch an elongated hole like this. Uh, let's say 50 as a radius we can fix we want coincidence between these two different element axis and let's click on coincidence and okay and uh, we can fix this distance let's say this time 200 okay and we can fix this axis here let's say 100 exit workbench and let's click on part and let's say 20 it's okay let's click on okay now we got this command enabled that we can use scaling let's click on scaling uh, as you can see we need to select reference normally we will use surface but the most important things that you need to know is say we've got two different elements but we've got a single part body and this operation is applied on the entire body so let's select the surface as a reference for example and let's change the ratio and this is what we've got let's say three and so on so we can scale along the z-axis and let's click on ok i do that one more time for example let's click scale and let's select the surface as a reference and now with this as a ratio let's click uh, let's say two and okay and this is what we got okay i can undo that with two click of our undo scaling definition one and two and now let's introduce the affinity command to use this command we need to as you can see we need to define let's say this is the correct position we need to fix an region so let's create a point with right click we can create a point this is our x-axis and I can fix as a position let's say uh, 10 preview let's say 25 and preview uh, okay now we need to select a plane and as you can see here we want a plane uh, it will be our yx plane to select this plane for example i can select this as our plane the zx plane okay and as a z axis x axis i can select for example uh, the y axis this so let's select y As you can see here, we've got our orientation changed. Now, if I click on X, as you can see, this is our X axis. I can increase the ratio along this direction. If I increase this, I can increase the ratio along this direction. And if I increase this, I can increase our ratio in this direction. The most important thing that you need to notice is that there is proportionality between our body, our pad, I should say, and uh, the distance from the origin. Okay, and let's click on OK. As always, if you like this content, please consider to subscribe, share, and so on. Let's see you soon.